The BJP held a crucial pre-poll meeting in Arunachal capital Itanagar today to discuss the party's election strategy besides giving a directive to party candidates to strictly adhere to election commission guidelines. Speaking to Northeast Light post the key meeting, Union Minister Kiran Rijiju reached out to those denied tickets by the BJP and urged them to stay in the BJP family. जिस जिस को बीजेपी टिकट नहीं मिला जो बीजेपी टिकट अप्लाई किया है उनको अपील किया जा रहा है कि वो इलेक्शन ना लड़े पार्टी के खिलाफ में और पार्टी का ऑफिशियल कैंडिडेट को साथ देने के लिए पार्टी ने अपील किया है क्योंकि पार्टी का टिकट तो एक आदमी तय नहीं करता है वो पार्टी तय करता है लेकिन हमारे लिए सब बराबर है जो टिकट मिला है बीजेपी का वो भी अपना है जो टिकट नहीं मिला वो भी अपना है मेरे दृष्टि से सब बराबर है और सरकार बनने के बाद सबको बराबर रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी दिया जाएगा कोई एम बनता है कोई पार्टी में रेस्पॉन्सिबिल लेता है कोई अलग रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी लेता है लेकिन सबका जिम्मेदारी होगा एंड किरेन रिजिजू ऑल्सो ब्रीफ्ड ऑन दी डिटेल्स ऑफ दी प्री पोल मीट दो पार्लियामेंट एम पी का जो कैंडिडेट्स और सिक्सटी असेंबली सीट्स का कैंडिडेट्स का बैठक हुआ इलेक्शन कैंपेन का दृष्टि से हम लोग ने क्या क्या करना चाहिए रूल्स के मुताबिक और एक स्टैंडर्ड इलेक्शन कैसे हो उसको लेकर के मीटिंग हुआ इलेक्शन रूल्स और रेगुलेशन को कोई वायलेट ना करें एज पर इलेक्शन कमीशन डायरेक्शन के मुताबिक शांति से अपना नॉमिनेशन करके पब्लिक के बीच में जाएंगे भारतीय जनता पार्टी का मेन मुद्दा क्या रहेगा और कैसे हम लोग पब्लिक को अपील करेंगे इसको लेकर के हम लोगों ने आ, कुछ पॉइंट्स को रखा है मोदी जी का नेतृत्व में एक वेव चल रहा है उसको अरुणाचल में कैसे लोगों तक पहुंचाना और पेमा खांडू जी के नेतृत्व में फिर से दोबारा बीजेपी का सरकार अरुणाचल में बनना चाहिए उसके लिए कुछ पॉइंट्स हम लोगों ने तैयारी की है Meanwhile, Arunachal election in charge for the BJP and Assam Minister Ashok Singhal predicted 55 seats for the BJP in the 60 member assembly. देखिए दो लोकसभा तो हम बहुत डिफरेंस बहुत मार्जिन से जीतने वाले हैं। रह गया विधानसभा का बात तो 60 सीटों पर हमारा तैयारी जीतने का है और आज जितने भी कैंडिडेट से बात हुआ सब जीतने के लिए उत्साह में हैं कि हम जीतने वाले हैं। एक दो मिस हो सकता है उससे ज़्यादा मिस नहीं होगा। 55 plus रहेगा। My colleague Marina Dai joins us over the phone line from Itanagar for more updates on this. So Marina, clearly the BJP in Arunachal facing the problem of plenty, but that does not seem to have dampened their confidence or their spirit in any way. As Ashok Singhal, the in charge for Arunachal today, clearly said that he is predicting the BJP to win at least 55 seats in the upcoming elections. What more would you like to add, Marina? Yes, first of all, Rona, yes, of course, in this today, the, the, this, uh, today's meeting was the first free poll meeting after the, uh, after the selected CJP candidates for the uh, Pradesh Assembly election. Uh, today, it held at the state BJP office, wherein the, uh, wherein after the state election in charge, a soft symbol was there, top uh, party leaders, including the chief minister, uh, BJP chief minister, and MPs uh, from both. Uh, East and West Parliament uh, were there, uh, along with the selected BJP candidates. Uh, yes, uh, what we have been learned from, uh, uh, from uh, you know, we speak to Asok Singhal, the state election in charge for Arunachal Pradesh. We spoke to him. He said that, uh, that there is a, there's a uh, good chances that BJP will again come into power in the state of Arunachal Pradesh. And we are very sure, very confident enough for the Lok Sabha seat. Both two MPs. Yes, Ronald, back to you. Right. Marina, also, you know, Union Minister Kiran Rijiju has appealed to those who could not secure tickets to not leave the party. So, is that the reason why we have not seen the three sitting MLAs joining the NPP yet today, or is their move confirmed? Ronald, um, as far as the three sitting MLAs are concerned, uh, what uh, what I have just learned from my sources is that uh, because due to some technical issues, uh, the sitting and the three sitting ambassadors not come uh, in the NPP office today. Uh, that is why the, the joining program could not take because they have to ha have a meeting with their core um, and party members. Until now, they 
uh, uh, like the SI, uh, the, the sitting MLA, uh, Wang Long Sawin, is having a party, meet, a party meeting with his uh, members uh, in, his res- in his residence right now. And yes, we have also spoken to uh, who we are. Uh, we had spoke to like some Simai who is the sitting at the lay from uh, Nampong constituency. We spoke to him, and uh, this is a big uh, this is a big breaking news at this point of time because we have just learned that uh, uh, like some Simai is now not joining the NPP, rather he is seeking the PPA PPA ticket. Uh, I am saying this again, like some Simai. The, the among the three sitting MLAs, like some Sima is seeking PP party now. We have just spoken and taken an interview with him. All right. All right, Marina, thank you very much for all those updates.